All right, so standing in front of an RMD cabinet, this is a 50 ton ambient. So typical layout when you open up a cabinet, you start over here, see you have the high voltage section. Over here is the low voltage controls. Then you have all your refrigeration below. On the D cabinet, the heating is actually below the fan on the side of the unit, which we, we're not gonna look at that right now. But So I wanted to walk you through the refrigeration cycle. So this is a dual circuit, four compressor unit. Typical arrangement for an Aon makeup air unit. I always like to start with the compressor. So the suction gas coming into the bottom of the compressor here on both circuits. The suction pressure, I don't know if you can zoom in on that, currently about 100 and, uh, 125 PSI and about 42 degree suction. So very much what we would like to see in a makeup air unit on a day like today. I think it's about 80 ish degrees out here, 85 degrees maybe. So that's what's going on with the suction now. The gas is coming in the compressor and it's being compressed into a high pressure, high temperature gas, which is going to go off to the condenser. You look at this temperature reading about 110 to 120 discharge of temperature and the pressure. It's about 375 PSIG. You can see the temperature in the gauge is, you know, close to 110-ish, something like that. So we're losing some degrees there. Now, the interesting thing about Aon units are most of them, especially if they're makeup air units, and we're dealing with some type of dehumidification, have a modulating hot gas reheat valve. This is a great example of that because you could follow the discharge gas here, the discharge gas line. It go, these two lines for both circuits go up behind the controls and, and high voltage panel area here. <laughs> Excuse me. And this is the valve here, the three-way valve. So you can see the temperature entering the three-way valve is about 102 degrees. You can show that sound. And you can see it goes through this three-way valve. Now some of it goes through circuit A, which is going to the condenser coil, which is on the top of this unit. And the other one, circuit B, is going to the modulating hot gas reed coil, which is going all the way here and into the cabinet. And later when we shut the unit off, we'll open this up and we'll show you what the mod we'll show you the modulating hot gas reheat coil and where it's located and how the gas comes to there. So that's the basic refrigeration cycle circuit of an Aon DOAS unit. Very similar on other units as well.